Hey guys, and welcome back to my channel. So, as you can tell, I'm not wearing any makeup. And as you see from the title of this video, this is a power of makeup video. So basically what I'm going to be doing in this video is um, I'm going to be doing makeup on only half of my face. So for whatever reason that you guys are doing makeup, whether it's to cover up your blemishes to make you more confident or if you just see it as an art, I'm telling you right now, do not care what other people think because there are some people out there that just don't like makeup and that's okay. That's fine. I personally love makeup, you guys know it. To me, it's like an art and it makes me feel more confident. With that being said, this video is going to be me applying makeup to half my face. You guys constantly see me without makeup. If you see me out in public, you've probably seen me without makeup. I don't wear it every day. I don't wear it all the time. Um, without further ado, let's just get right into the video. This is the side I'm going to be doing makeup on, mostly because the lighting is better over here and it's easier for me to see. This side is the one I'm going to be leaving bare. Let's start with my brows like I usually would. I'm just going to fill in my brows. Measurable Difference Concealer Palette. This is what I've been using to do my under brow with just because it's very like pigmented, although it's very thick. And So let's prime, prime my face and I'm going to be using the Hourglass Primer like I've been using for I don't even know how long. So this side of my face is primed. And in this video, we're going to be testing out a new foundation. I'm super excited. I actually applied for this online to get a sample of it because um, Makeup Forever is not a brand that I typically use, like, ever, honestly. I don't think I've ever used them on my channel. I don't own anything by them. They're just pretty high-end for me, but their quality is there. And I got it in the color Y225, which I really hope is my right color. I'm going to be applying it with my Real Techniques sponge, which I have been, like, pretty much in love with lately. Oh wow, this is like a, wow, this is really nice match, honestly. Pretty, pretty nice match, I would say. So already you can see the difference in my face, so with makeup, without makeup. I love foundation because it covers up all of my redness, and that's something that I'm really, really insecure about. If you guys know me in person, you probably know that about me. I only used one pump of this. One pump for half of my face. That's perfect. Love it. Okay, so now we're going to conceal and I'm going to be using my Wet n Wild concealer like I've been using for like the last year of my life. This is so weird. But I've been thinking of doing this video for a long time. Not really a long time, but just really since I've started getting into makeup because I mean, like I said, this is a really hard community. Like this is like, some people are just for it, and some people just aren't. But I just thought that I'd do this video kind of to give you guys a little bit of inspiration. Okay, like, pause. I need to I need to talk about this because this foundation is freaking beautiful. It says Invisible Cover Foundation. And, like, I don't feel it. It's a little tacky. Actually, I think that's my concealer. Yeah, that's my concealer. It just, oh my, it just feels, it looks so good, right? It just looks so good, yeah. Now I'm going to use my um, Bare Minerals Powder. You guys know I've been loving this lately. And it shouldn't take me that long since I'm only doing half my face, you would think. But probably just means that I was just... But I'm just setting pretty much everywhere, honestly. I set like on top of my eye, my forehead, just to really make everything set and stay. Let's do this one. This one you can't even get anymore, so I feel so bad for using it on my channel, but... Really, it's got standard colors in it. I mean, you can find these probably anywhere. The Too Faced um, Christmas in New York Mary Macaroons Vanilla Scented Palette. So I'm just taking Coconut, which is this light shade up here, and I'm just setting my eye with it. I'm not going to do too... I don't know if I'm going to do too crazy of a look. Then I'm taking Dulce de Leche and putting this in my crease. I freaking love this crease color, or like this transition shade. So now I'm going to take... Mint chocolate. When I use this palette, I do the same exact crease colors. And I'm just going to put that on the lower part of my crease. So just right under where I put the other colors at. And just kind of putting that back and forth. Um, let's deepen it up with almond mocha. I'm going to put this on the outer V of my eye. So now I'm going to take... Take Honey Lavender, and this is going to go all over my lid. Foundation, and it's going to go in the order that... Now I'm taking 
almond mocha once again on like a little on a little brush blending a little bit more around the edges just to soften some things up now let's apply liner I'm just gonna take this this my essence one I am gonna do a wing and you know what I love about this I don't even have to match my sides because I'm only doing one side hmm. I'm using the Doucet, um mascara. You guys know I freaking love this stuff. So I'm going to bronze. I'm going to use my Hoola bronzer. And I've been using this Moda Pro pointed blush brush. You know, it helps to blend, but it also helps to keep your bronzer like where it needs to be, you know? So today for highlight, I'm going to use my Wet n Wild highlighter. You guys know I've been loving this one. It's just so good. This is in Precious Petals, right? Yeah, precious petals. So I'm finished with my makeup look. I just need to do my lips. This NYX Soft Matte Lip Cream, I love these. This is in the color Budapest. So I'm going to do half my lips and the other half I'm not going to do. So this is the completed makeup look. And I know I look absolutely insane, but that's the point okay guys so i know i look so crazy right now because i only have half of my face done this is a completed look so this side i have makeup on and this side i have no makeup on i'm just here to show you guys the power of makeup and this is what